Come view this shadow box dining table with us. Our client loves walnut wood, but she wanted the bottom to be black. So we decided to use 3 quarter inch ash to make the bottom of the box. Now was the fun part. We got 2 inches thick black walnut to make the boxes trim and frame. We got the straight edges and attached the trim to the bottom with festool dominoes and then we started working on the walnut frame in the same way. This was just a dry fit before we could glue everything up and here you can see how many dominoes were used to make these boxes. After we painted the bottom in black, it was time to start gluing up the walnut part. As you can imagine, this was the hardest part of all. We had to work fast, so using tight bone 3 was the best option. We've literally used most of our clamps plus a few extra straps to keep it all in place. We let it sit overnight and then the next day we sanded everything down to 120 grit and then it was time to finish this beauty. We used Rubio Monocoat Oil Plus 2C in Pure for the perfect color pop. We've added some quarter inch thick trims inside the box, that's where the glass will sit on. Then we installed this gorgeous black metal base and our shadow box table is ready for a client to fill it up and add the glass top. Let us know if you have any questions in the comments below and thanks for watching.